Welcome guys, today we are going to upgrade my own personal AI assistant powered with an ASP32. In this video I'm going to add a new feature and I'm going to solder all the components into a PCB. Before starting soldering all the components I would like to introduce you this project. Basically a user will ask a question to the ASP32 and the ASP32 will save his question with a microphone connected to the ASP32. Then this file audio will be sent with an HTTP connection to my PC and then my PC with a Python code will generate a response with an OpenAI model and that response will be sent back to the ASP32. The ASP32 will save this file audio and then it will play this file audio with a Bluetooth speaker. I've made two videos about it, one dedicated to the Bluetooth connection and one for the logic and the code. I will link the two videos in the description, so let's start soldering everything. So the first thing that I've decided to do was to glue these two PCB together because uh, alone they don't have enough space for the components of today's video. The result is optimal for what we are looking for. Then you can see that I've decided to put my ASP in this position with the microphone. After this I'm going to solder all the pins that I need for this project. So as you can see all the pin of the microphone has been soldered but not all the pin of the ASP. The first connections that I'm making are between the microphone and the ASP32. And while you are looking at the soldering, there will also be a schematic that helps you understand what connections I am soldering. Now that I have soldered all the connections between my ASP32 and the microphone, I'm now adding these two LED that will help me to understand when it's time to record the audio and when it's time to turn on the Bluetooth speaker. To solder these two LED I'm using a 220 ohms resistor for both LED and then I'm connecting the other pin to the ground. And now that all the components are soldered correctly we are going to try it. So right here I have the project and uh, as you can see I have also 3D printed this stand. I will share the SDL file but now we are going to try it. So. I have right here also the GBL and the USB-C cable. Now we are going to power it on and uh, it should be working. Hi ASP32, can you give me the secret for the success on YouTube? Now the record is ended and uh, we are now waiting for the PC to create the file audio and then for the ASP to save it on the flash file system. Now that the yellow LED is on, we have to turn on the JBL. Engaging content consistency and audience interaction. Now we know the secret of YouTube success. Thank you guys for watching. You will find every link in the description, like the GitHub link that contains all the code and also a folder dedicated to the configuration. I will also put the links to my personal website where I put every project. Thank you for all the support and uh, I will keep doing these videos. I will certainly try to improve my projects and I also try to keep pushing with new projects that are harder than the previous one. So if you like these ideas, if you like these videos, this channel, make sure to subscribe and we will see on the next one.